like an earthquake What's up YouTube, DJ Chronics again here today. Um, today we're we'll doing a tutorial on how to get uh, police cars or any kind of vehicles into your Grand Theft Auto 4 uh, for PC. Uh, first you want to want to do is find a car that you would like. Um, you can get my cars from lcpdfr.com. Uh, I'll be posting the links in the description for this uh, specific vehicle. So today we're gonna be downloading a 2000 Chevy Silverado. Um, when you're installing a vehicle, you gotta check through this to make sure it uh, reaches your minimum minimum uh, requirements. And yeah, so first you wanna do is you're gonna wanna download it. Um, so let's get this downloaded. Yeah, with um LCPDFR's website, you gotta go through security check every time. Boat, car, the money, and I guess that's it. Wait, I'm gonna pause this video. Let's pause that. There we go. As you see, it started downloading. I'll skip through this, um, because it's gonna take quite a while. It's like 9.9 .9 megabytes. So I'll skip through that, and yeah. So, once it's done downloading, you're going to want to minimize your screen and then drag that um, file, the truck, into your desktop for now. Just in case if you ever want to use it again or if you have a problem with your game, you will want to use, uh, keep it. So, next, um, just a little heads up, you guys will be needing WinRAR and Spark IV. So, these two things. So first you're gonna to wanna to open up the wait, hold on. first thing you're gonna to wanna to open up the truck file or the vehicle file and then some of them are gonna look like this look like this so you open it up and then they have pictures the handling text but we're just gonna do the files and these are pole patriot well I'm gonna switch it to an end stockade because I already have a vehicle in the pole patriot section so just close that, drag it to your desktop, and then if you want to rename them, you just got to rename it to and Stucky. Okay. There they go. Next, you're going to want to open up your Spark IV. And if you have Open IV, it's like the same thing. Um, so once you open it up, click on the GTA uh, 4 browse thing. Uh, let's just wait for this to load up. So once this is loaded up, um, you're going to want to scroll all the way to the bottom and open up uh, CD images. So once you open that up, you go to vehicles, that image, you open that up, and then you click on import. Once you click on that, you go to your desktop, and you scroll all the way down until you see the files. So you click on these. And then you press open, and then you know they're gonna be in once you see a blue highlighted thing. Oh, they're gonna be highlighted blue around them. So you find it. Where are they? There they are, right here. And then after you're done with putting it in and all that, you're gonna click save. There, and then close it. And then once again, you're gonna also click save. There you go. And then now we're just gonna um, load up the game. I'll skip through this so it doesn't, um, you guys don't have to be waiting through it. Sorry. Okay, so once you open up your game, uh, you're gonna wanna go down outside so you can spawn the truck. You don't wanna spawn in here. But you go outside, and then you open up your console, or you can open it with your trainer. I prefer with the console, and then you type in spawn. And stockade. Pretty simple. Oh wait, I spelled it wrong. There we go. And as you can see, there it is. 
So let's see, let's test drive it, make sure, oh, okay, I guess I got want to go flip it. Let's just find another one. <laughs> Ah, oh, dang it. Keep getting errors. There we go. Okay, now let's hopefully we don't get any problems. Don't hit it. Huh. Once it's open, you get in a truck. It's actually a really nice truck. Just gotta put the handling text on it. So let's shut off uh, Native Trainer so I can test the lights. So as you can see, they work. Um, in my next video, I'm probably gonna be doing um, a lighting fix and how to fix your visual settings at that file. So that's basically it. Uh, if you guys like this video, please hit that like button and. If you guys didn't like this video, uh, just post a comment on what you guys didn't like, and don't forget, please, uh, please subscribe. Thank you.